Yeah, yeah. Um, okay, so I was driving about maybe an hour and a half. And we came and we pulled over to a McDonald's and I got in line to order. And someone asked me to pop the trunk and you can't pop the trunk while you're in drive. So I put it in park. And when I put it in park, I took my, my foot off the brake. And when I did that, the car kept rolling. I was like, what the fuck? So I, I broke real quick. And I tried to put it in drive to see if it was, what the fuck was going on. And when I did that, it wouldn't let me even move the the stick. It was locked. So the shifter's locked. Yeah, the shifter's locked. And then the car turned off. It, the car turned off? Yeah. Oh, wow. So what gear is it in now? It, it says park, but it's in drive. Okay, what size engine do you have? Is this a four cylinder or a V6? A 2.0. Two okay. Well, it says 2.0, but it might. I don't think it's a 4.0. I can check those. No, that's all right. It's fine. Yeah, because it says it's a 2000, uh, 2014 Cadillac 2.0 turbo. Okay. So I, I put the stick all the way to park, and then I took my foot off the brake, and it kept moving. And then when I looked down, the the drive, the D, is yeah. red. So it's saying it's in drive, but it's not. The stick is all the way in the park. Okay. So that's, that's why, I don't know. <clears throat> so can you push the vehicle? Like, no, does it? Uh, yeah, we pushed it over. I pushed it over. Okay, so the, the so the transmission the transmission is certainly not in park then. No. Okay. All right. <clears throat> well, and I'm and your question to me is how do you fix it or what could be wrong or. Yeah, well, well both of those. To be honest, I'm sitting here, you know, stranded. So. <laughs> so it sounds to me like the shifter assembly has either come apart, come loose, or broke, or maybe the shift cable between the shifter assembly and the transmission. Something came apart, right? Now, we may never know, you know, you may not know, I may not know until somebody gets in there and has a look. What we would do at the shop is we would just, we would take things apart until we could, I could see that shift cable and uh, yeah. to d determine basically where it has come apart. I don't think this is going to be something that's going to be done in, in a parking lot, you know, late at night. So I'm thinking it's either A, going to need to get towed, or you're going to have to call a mobile mechanic during business hours so that he, they can come out and take a look at it. Yeah. And, like, I try to I try to turn the car on, but the brake is, it's like, locked. So it's a push to start. So when I go and do it, I push the thing, but it, the the lights will flicker, and then only the electric, the electronics will turn on. The car won't try to turn on. That bit. Well, so keep in mind, so if the transmission's still in drive, right, it, it won't start. Yeah. So th fixing this alone might help, might might resolve the issue, but flickering usually indicates low system voltage. So I would just make sure that we don't have a battery issue. Um, you know, make sure that the battery is fully charged, make sure it passes a load test, make sure the fuses are good, make sure the brake lights work. <laughs> Sometimes if you got a brake, uh, a faulty brake light switch, um, it usually what happens is it prevents it from coming out of park. This is like the worst time too. Uh... Yeah. <clears throat> So when you when you press the button, you, does it still click when you try to start it? Which button? The start button. Right, well, I press. I put my foot on the gas or the brake, and then I'll go and I'll hold the the power off, but it won't it won't do nothing. All it does is turn on the radio and like the air and all that. Okay, so it's not clicking now. No, it well, I don't I don't understand what you mean by clicking, but I know like the. The car itself just won't turn on. Okay. But I know. So you don't hear the starter. You don't see the lights flash at all. That's what I mean by flickering or clicking. You don't see the lights flash when you try to start it. Like which ones? Because like all, all, all of them. I have my hazards on, the 
the all of them. All, yeah, all the lights are all on. All that, and that's not what I'm asking. I'm asking, do you see the lights flickering, flashing when you try to start it? Yes or no? Try to start it. Like the, what is it called? The dash? It'll flicker on, like when it turns on. But it won't like turn on and off and then back on. It just does it once and Okay. All right. It doesn't sound like a battery issue. <clears throat> so I'm thinking it's going to be something related to, to either the shift shift cable or the shifter assembly. So if you want, what I can do for you is I can connect you with a mobile mechanic that you yeah. can get, you can give them a call and, and, dur- and I don't think they're open now, but at least during normal business hours, they can come out and take a look at it. Okay. Would that help out? Okay, yeah, just reply back online. Let me know. Okay. All right, good luck. Bye-bye.